fight was doing drugs. Oh, being famous. Oh. So you're basically saying that this, this little evidence piece right here, the little baggie of drugs, you're telling me that your client had these near him and they are his. Where does this yes. come in with the the defendant? So the investigators said originally that it could be the people who attacked him or it could be his. So what you're saying you're is it was basically... Go ahead. Yeah, so you're basically um... saying that they are his. You're admitting to that. So couldn't he have just... Uh... Overdosed and well, yes, he could have, but the investigators found many footprints, many dirty shoe footprints at the scene, which were not my clients. And do you, do you have, have any regarding the? Yes, do you have proof? Not with us right now, no. So far, he's well. not guilty. He has never, he hasn't given any real evidence. Nope. I have proof. I don't have proof. After all this happened. Kermit, let I'm me tell proof. you. If, if anything, you're making <coughs> your client look even worse right now. Yeah. yeah. I'm just using the pieces of so, evidence that were given to me, my honor. When you give of evidence, you got to give the evidence that the other person has done to your client, not what your client has carried on them, such as the drugs given to us. Also, you gave us weapons that are copies when we needed the actual weapons that were used on the crime scene. The investigators are still scanning the weapons for any sort of this. Yeah, but we need so the evidence, or else it's just a lost cause for your client. That means your client could possibly go to jail for intoxication on...